And yes, it's carbon fiber, but it's not really beautiful. So let's try another carbon fiber project. In this try, I use three layers of 200 gram carbon fiber. Um, then I have the peel apply and polyester felt. And this uh, vacuum bag. This small guy was just to get the sharp angle here. So there it is. The ceiling does fit. And uh, just one problem was I'm here a little bit offset. As you can see here, it's like one millimeter, and here it's like uh, two millimeter. And we have another epoxy coating on the top. But uh, yeah, I think that's it. Now I start to repair these uh, here parts where the resin is left. And to fill the holes, I have a silicon tape and we, we build like a barrier like in the video of easy composite and I hope it will work So the question I wanted to answer was, can you craft your own carbon fiber parts? And yes, of course you can, but it's a huge work and the finish is not the perfect one. So don't expect to be perfect at the first try. Um, you see here my second try and I will do another video with my first try and what I've learned in the first one, because uh, you don't have to make the same mistakes. And you need a lot of stuff, so you need something to cut it, you need gloves, you need, uh, you need a mask when you cut it, um, you need tape, you need resin, so it was a lot of stuff you really need. So the question, can you craft your own carbon fiber parts? Yes, you can. But is it possible to do a lot of them to sell them?
That's really hard. I think no, because then you need really, really good molds. But thanks for watching. And uh, if you're interested, check out my other videos with uh, 3D printing about the Toyota MR2 Mark 1.